Some of the fastest, most powerful, most unique, and luxurious motor vehicles are supercars. Once you've tasted the freedom of driving one of these magnificent beasts, an ordinary car just won't feel the same. What's up guys? Welcome to another video. Today we have something special for you. We will not only be talking about supercars, but the most unique of them all. But before we begin, make sure to hit the subscribe button and press the bell icon so you'll never miss an update from us ever again. Well, get seated with your seatbelts on before we dive into the countdown, starting from number 10, Novatech 720S N Largo. Using the McLaren 720S Super Series model as its canvas, Novatech took this car to the next level, drawing much of its inspiration from McLaren's own halo car, the Senna. The most notable features of the car would be its exterior dressings, effectively increasing its width by 60 millimeters in the front and a whopping 130 meters in the rear. With a reimagined roof scoop, new air inlets, and quite a large double-decker spoiler completing the transformation. Thankfully, Novatech's interpretation of the 720S is not merely limited to the beauty of the car, it also has an additional power package to it. With a 4.0 liter twin turbo V8 engine, seeing its power and torque bumped up to 795 bhp from 711 bhp and to 648 pounds feet from 568 pounds feet. The N Largo retains the rear wheel drive configuration, which has resulted in a car that can achieve a 0 to 60 miles per hour or 96.5 kilometers per hour in just 2.0 seconds, with a top speed of 215 miles per hour or 346 kilometers per hour. Before moving on, here's a shout out to some of our subscribers. Now up on to number 9, we have the AMG GTR by Fosla. As if the 577 bhp Mercedes AMG GTR wasn't powerful enough, the German tuner Fosla has added up even more to it, giving it an extra 64 horsepower and 52 pound feet of torque. Part of the first level of performance enhancement for the AMG GTR allows the 4.0 liter twin turbo V8 engine to produce an impressive 641 horsepower. While the performance figures are yet to be released for this car, the standard car can go from 0 to 62 miles per hour in just 3.6 seconds with a top speed of 199 miles per hour. The additional 64 horsepower should make it hit the 62 miles per hour or 99.7 kilometers per hour mark faster than 3.6 seconds, and the top speed will be well over 200 miles per hour or 321.8 kilometers per hour. Talk about the pricing, well, the kit has not been announced yet, but expect it to be a rather extreme amount given the number of tune-ups received by the Mercedes AMG GTR. Coming next on number 8 is Jaguar F-Type Lister. Lister has surely followed a recipe to create a monster to produce this 666 horsepower Jaguar. Even calling this a monster does not add up to its capabilities. Starting out life as an F-Type convertible, the LFT-C is the drop-type version of Lister's LFT-C 666 Coupe, and it gets the same tuning treatment to raise the Jaguar's benchmark from a 5-liter V8 engine with a 550 horsepower to a diabolical 666, giving it a top speed of over 205 miles per hour or 330 kilometers per hour, and an acceleration of 0 to 60 miles per hour or 0 to 100 kilometers per hour in just 3.2 seconds, with a roaring, extremely loud exhaust. To add on to all this, this car has a custom intercooler and air filter with a new engine management system. Well, if you think $170,000 sounds heavy, don't worry. Lister's making just 10 of them anyways. Moving on to the next car here, on number 7 we have the McLaren F1 LM. A normal McLaren F1 is an icon, and five of these LM versions were created to commemorate the F1 GTRs, which wrote history in 1995. Back in the day, McLaren didn't even announce an official price for the McLaren F1 LM, but it's believed to be in excess of about a million dollars. Today it's worth a lot more. The McLaren F1 LM is much more than just another replica of a race car. It is actually lighter and more powerful than the GTR race car. In addition to that, LM also features a lower, stiffer, and track-tuned suspension and a stripped-down interior. Aerodynamic enhancements and stickier tires allow the LM to corner and accelerate more adeptly than the regular F1. 
What makes it so special is that this is probably the only McLaren F1 you can drive on public roads and enjoy the racing specifications. Number 6. Koenigsegg CCXR Trevita. Trevita is a Swedish abbreviation that translates to three whites. The Koenigsegg visible carbon weave bodywork is renowned around the globe for its uniqueness and perfection and stated as one of the most beautiful cars ever made. Performance-wise, this car can accelerate from 0 to 100 km per hour or 0 to 62 miles per hour in just 2.9 seconds. With a top speed of more than 410 km per hour or 254 miles per hour and a weight to power ratio of 1.26 kg per horsepower. With the power of 1,018 horsepower and a 4.8 liter V8 engine, well unfortunately only three of them were ever made. One of which was bought by the famous boxer Floyd Mayweather for which he paid $4.8 million in 2015. Coming up next is the BMW i8 Roadster. With the production of the BMW i8 Roadster, it is now possible to drive a car that combines luxury, high performance, and positive environmental attributes. Although, those three things combined don't come cheap. With a bottom line price of $166,795, it offers a 0 to 60 miles per hour time of just 4.4 seconds. The i8 also offers 18 miles of electric only driving via its 11.6 kilowatt hour lithium battery and can reach 75 miles per hour solely on battery power. Though the electric motor is only 141 horsepower, it is 12 horsepower more than the 2017 model. It also produces 184 foot-pounds of torque and doesn't feel slow. The production cycle of the i8 ended in June 2020. In addition, just 3,884 Roadsters were produced. Number 4. Ferrari 812 Superfast by Novatech with the German background, Novatech specializes in the tuning of Italian, British, and American cars with the latest upgrade of Tesla. The Novatech 812 Superfast runs on a 6.5 liter V12 engine with 789 horsepower, 588 kilowatts, and a torque of 530 pound feet, which assists the car to go from 0 to 62 miles per hour or 0 to 100 kilometers per hour in a mind blowing 2.9 seconds with a top speed of over 211 miles per hour or 340 kilometers per hour. To negotiate everyday obstacles such as up and down ramps, Novatech offers the front lift system which allows raising the vehicle body at the front axle by 40 millimeters at the touch of a button. Another Novatech specialty is crafting exclusive interiors tailored to the vehicle owner's preferences in every detail with regard to color and design. Needless to say, Novatech knows its pricing for them Ferrari owners, so you can bet everything will be expensive. A base 812 Superfast goes for about $335,000. Number 3. La Voiture Noire A pioneering spirit, passion for perfection, and desire to continually redefine its limits have been the key characteristics of Bugatti since it was founded more than 110 years ago. Bugatti set off an avalanche of buzz when it revealed its La Voiture Noire at the 2019 Geneva Motor Show. Not long after, news outlets reported that the Noir had been purchased by an unnamed buyer for the highest new car price ever, $18.7 million so far. The car has a single piece body handcrafted from carbon fiber with rear fascia featuring six exhaust pipes. With an 8 liter quad turbo 16 cylinder engine and torque of 1180 pounds feet, the car can speed from 0 to 62 or 100 km per hour in just 2.4 seconds. The most unique aspect of this car is the Lanoir's signature design details over the top style recalls the iconic Bugatti Type 57 SC Atlantic, only four of which were built between 1936 and 1938. Number 2. 2020 Maguari HS1 GTC The Maguari HS1 GTC is a far cry from the luxury limos that the company built in the early 20th century. Named after the Stork, native to South America, the Maguari HS1 GTC really does fly. A 0 to 62 miles per hour or 0 to 100 kilometers per hour time of just 2.8 seconds has been reported with a limited top speed of 236 miles per hour or 380 kilometers per hour which is electronically limited. Those impressive figures are achieved thanks to a V10 mid-engine that is said to be from the Lamborghini Huracan mated to a 7-speed paddle shift gearbox which sends the power to the rear wheels. 
However, instead of the 602 horsepower that the Italian supercar puts out, the Maguari HS1 GTC develops a crazy 1200 horsepower at 8200 RPMs, thanks to the addition of two turbos and e-compressors. But unlike the cars from those YouTube drag races, the Maguari HS1 GTC still has all of its carbon fiber bodywork intact. In fact, it's quite a pretty thing, with sharp lines making it something of a Batmobile cross with a Noble M600. These exclusively limited edition cars come with a price tag of over $2.45 million, and only 300 of them are in existence. Before getting into number one, make sure you annihilate that subscribe button and leave a comment for a shout out in one of our next videos. And topping the chart on number one, we have 2020 Ferrari P80C. It's not easy to stand out in the high dollar world of custom Ferraris, but the P80C manages exactly that with its unique style. Mixing old school inspiration with the cutting edge go fast technology, the P80C manages to shuck the constraints of both competition homologation and street legality, and the result is bold and gorgeous. Ferrari spent almost four years developing the 2020 P80C and to build a unique track car. Ferrari engineers and designers have been hard at work since 2020, its designer successfully catches historical beauty and mates it with modern aerodynamic perfection. The car uses an unrestricted version of the 3.9 liter turbocharged V8 from a 488 GT3 and claims the car is 5% more efficient than the GT3 and efficiency needed to utilize the unrestricted engine. This car has a top speed of 211 miles per hour or 340 kilometers per hour. There was once an anonymous buyer who commissioned the Ferrari P80C and wanted it to reflect some of the design mastery of history's greatest models, including the Ferrari 330P34 and the Dyno 206S and 250 LM Berlinettas. The car has been designed with a racing setup in mind, which features a carbon fiber wing and 18-inch wheels. It can also be converted to an exhibition package by removing the aerodynamic appendages and having it fitted with 21-inch wheels. Following the Ferrari legacy, the car base price is around $4 million to $5 million.